hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you in ASP.NET how to set the max size or length to the text box control using jQuery and here we got a new output after adding the jQuery functionality let's enter the characters notice it's taking exactly the 10 characters 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 0 after zero, I can't be able to type. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. Notice in this webform.aspx page, which contains a headed access one hits to horizontal line. After the horizontal line, I'm adding one text box control. Go to toolbox, come to the bottom, text box control. And I'm adding the text board. Is multi-line and max length is equals to. I'm adding ten. Let's check the output. The maximum length is allowed in this text box control is ten characters. Google Chrome. And here we got the output of that code which contains the header X, horizontal line and one text box control which is a multi-line mode. Let's enter the maximum length we have set the 10 characters of this text box control. If I type, see the max length we have set the 10 characters in this text box control. But we have entered more than 10 characters. So the max length property is not working on this text box control. So now I'm using jQuery functionality to set the max size for this text box control. When we are implementing jQuery functionality, the first thing we require the latest jQuery serial link. Let's add that one. jQuery latest serial Google. And from such results, I'm selecting the hosted libraries. In Google hosted libraries, notice at the corner there is a contents panel which contains jQuery. Select that one. Here you can find different CDNs of jQueries. I'm selecting the version 3.3.1. Let's copy this snippet and add in our web form page. Let's stop the debugging. In the header section, I'm adding. After that, the max length property is not working, so delete this one. I'm adding the max size is equals to 10. After that, I'm adding the script tag. Inside the script, I'm adding the max length functionality to this text box control. Dollar between double quotes. Here our controller is the text box control, but when we render on the browser, the text box control contains a multi-line, so it's become the text area. The browser converts this text box control into text area, so I'm adding text area. The max size dot each function. dollar this dot I'm adding the attribute between single quotes max length comma dollar this dot attribute single quotes I'm adding the max size semicolon. That's it we have added the jQuery snippet to set the maximum size or length to this text box control. I am reloading the browser link again. I 
and here we got a new output after adding the jQuery functionality. Let's enter the characters. Notice it's taking exactly the 10 characters. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 0. After 0, I can't be able to type. As I told, when we render the text box control on the browser, the browser treats the text box control as a text area. Let's view the view source, view page source. And notice here, instead of text box, we got here text area. That's it.